City of Detroit is reaching out, hoping to hear from people about the good, bad, and ugly experiences they're having in neighborhoods. Thanks for being with us here for the news at 5.30. I'm Kimberly Gill. And I'm Demond Fernandez. We're talking about safety, schools, child care, illegal dumping, and so much more. Now, this is all part of a survey the city and its partners are sponsoring in hopes of using that data to make some positive changes across communities. And right now, the deadline to share your ideas is quickly approaching. It's another chance for residents across the city of Detroit to make their voices heard and share perspectives about their neighborhoods with city leaders and groups working to help bring about change. When it comes to improving the neighborhood, what would you like to see done? Well, one thing is, is, is a lot of crime around here, you know. John Earl lives on Detroit's west side, and he's among residents just learning about a neighborhood vitality index survey that's out right now. It's a survey that's gathering input on Detroiters' lived experiences and perceptions around a variety of quality of life issues. If there's anything top of mind for you right now that you'd like to see improvement-wise, who would it be, Jeff? Uh, the schools. District schools. Jeff and Lachelle Bohorski are also just learning about the survey. The Neighborhood Vitality Index is asking Detroiters to chime in on issues about safety, education, illegal dumping, vacant homes, access to health care resources, transportation, and other topics. We really are trying to push to hear from all Detroit residents over the age of 18, as many as we can get to take the survey. Jane Morgan is president of JFM Consulting Group. That company's working with the city, data-driven Detroit, and community development advocates of Detroit to collect and analyze the data. It's important that we hear from residents directly so that investments are directly reflecting what the residents need. But time is running out. The Neighborhood Vitality Index survey deadline of October 31st is quickly approaching maybe driving crazy around or whatever. Terry Crawford is another Detroiter who says he'll be checking out the survey to share his ideas and experiences. The organizers say there's an incentive for residents who fill out the Neighborhood Vitality Index by the deadline. You'll receive a $25 Visa gift card upon completion. Now, organizers told me so far more than 500 people have completed the survey online, but they want to hear from so many more Detroiters. Now, Kimberly, I did check out that survey. I mm -hmm. took it this morning myself. It only took about 10 minutes. Yeah. And again, the deadline is October 31st. And if you do fill out that survey, you do at the end, put your information, and you'll be sent a $25 that's, gift card. Yeah, that's a nice incentive and nice that they're asking for the input from yeah. residents. So. You know, they're saying that the only way they can make change is if you let your voices heard. Exactly. So, yeah. There you go. Make your voices heard. All right.